Hey everyone, I'm starting this video from bed because it's my last day of vacation. Yay, I'm super excited. I'm gonna get up and turn my lights on and get ready for the day. So, I don't really know what I want to wear to this. I usually wear sweatpants every day. You can see how like puffy my face is caused from steroids too. I just like to mention that. But I've been um kind of just putting on sweatpants every day and like a shirt. That does like not a hoodie because I can't wear that with my my mask but I still have to like do the treatment today so I'm trying to like figure out what is the best thing to wear for clarification the first 13 sessions of this I had to like put on the a medical gown which I'm so happy I don't have to do that anymore because it just took a long a long time well I'm thinking I don't know what I'm thinking I feel like everyone's gonna look good and then I'm gonna walk downstairs and be underdressed <laughs> for my own thing. I don't know. Um, yeah. Hmm. I'll figure it out and I'll come back. Okay, so I kind of panicked and I am just wearing jeans and a sweater. I'll do a little fit check. It took me like five minutes to, to think about that. So I'm very excited to finally be done. It's something that has uh, I've had to go to every day. So I didn't get to finish my monologue about being excited for the last day, but it's been a long six weeks and I'm very happy to just hopefully to heal my head from all of this because the side effects and everything get to you and I'm just hoping that I won't be dizzy it's my biggest thing and yeah the world is good <laughs> hello what are we doing last day radiation yay where are we we're at the New York Post Health Center okay. on 126th Street okay uh, yay So what are you doing right now, Bella? What is this? Filling out the form. So you have to select um, that you haven't had COVID symptoms and then put your name of all the visitors. Aunt Cindy, mom, dad, sis. Now we're going to my room. I used to be in room three and now I'm in room four. <laughs> What's the difference? Um, so the first one, the laser was like Shooting, Ethan was going from under, and now this goes from the side. They have my favorite Bryson Tiller playing around. So they have what's playing? Bryson Tiller. Shout out Bryson Tiller, my favorite. Oh, so it's like a vibe in here. Yeah. <laughs> So excited, gonna ring that bell. Never thought I'd be ringing a bell, but I'll be ringing that bell. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> yep. <laughs> so that's a wrap on radiation. Almost two out of three done. Where are we going now? Who would die? Yeah, I think it might be our fiftieth bed here, but it's my first time here, I believe. And what's your favorite food? I love like pad thai and thai food. My pad thai is here. How the person with one hand that will eat that? I don't know. Okay. Just like a cake. Really good. Really yummy. I'm about to go to sleep after my first day. No radiation. Well, tomorrow's man, no radiation, but first day being done. Did my nighttime routine. <laughs> and I've been having like this is just how I feel. I'm just gonna say how I feel. My head has hurt a lot the past few days. Um, but the thing is, you can really tell how much it affects you because Sunday I felt pretty good. Like I wasn't really dizzy, I could walk fine. 
stuff like that and the pe monday even after monday like tuesday today i feel pretty bad um i'm feeling very nauseous and it's, yeah it's just waves because you can feel great one day and then horrible the next and it's frustrating but it is what it is and you can't really control how you feel like you wake up sometimes not feeling super bad and then the rest of the day hits you or you can wake up feeling super bad and just have to get through the whole day and i'm hoping tomorrow tomorrow's my big gma interview i hope i wake up not feeling bad and not feeling nauseous and not as dizzy and just my head don't have a headache because i just want to feel more normal for that day or tomorrow but peace out it's probably like 10 o'clock but i have to wake up early so i'm gonna go to bed bye